Good morning, travelers. Well, yeah, not really morning anymore. <laughs> I had a bit of a sleep in. We're out here on my balcony for a change, going through the Prince William Sound. And it is day two of my Grand Princess cruise tour, the cruise portion. So today I actually have an excursion where I'm going on a ship that is going to pull up to the ship we're going to stop at some point in the ocean. And uh, we're going to have it come up just like a tender would. And we're going to get on the ship and it's going to, or boat, and it's going to take us away. And we're going to go and see Hubbard Glacier up close and personal. So I'm looking forward to that. Okay, I'll let you know how that all goes. No, it would be cool if like that was <laughs> no, we can get cannonballs. Oh, yeah. Hello. Hello fellow travelers. It is the end of day two and it's been quite a day. Um, so my shore excursion was called the Hubbard Glacier and Wilderness Exploration and it was a three-decker boat that pulled upside the ship as we were uh, at sea before we had gotten into you know all that close to land and they load us, loaded us all up. There was quite a lot of people on this ship too. I mean it really seemed to hold quite a lot. It didn't feel crowded either so that was nice. We all met at the Crown Grill at 3 p.m. and then they herded us all off the ship and I immediately headed up to the second deck. Uh, there were three decks and I thought well the second deck there was a nice viewing area outside plus an area inside and so I could leave my big backpack inside and you know pull out the pieces I needed and go out and film and everything and that worked out really well the top deck is entirely just an observation deck there's no shelter from the wind so it's really cold up there it was pretty cold on the second deck but there was a little bit of shelter because you know halfway it's it's actual 
walls and building and glass and all that sort of thing. And then it's open area. So the wind was a little bit buffered by the, the front of the ship. But yeah, it was really, really good. Caught several calving events, made a short of the biggest one. And yeah, it was beautiful. The glacier is just gorgeous. It's got these stripes of blue that you'll see in the footage and it's just amazing. And it was quite active and, and our guide said that, you know, it's an advancing glacier, which means it's continuing to head to the, the sea, so to speak. So it's, it's calving quite a bit and it was active. It was definitely active. If you get a chance to do it, I highly recommend taking that because Hubbard is a very active glacier and that was amazing. We also saw a couple of harbor seals. I did not get them on t on video because as soon as we came close to them, they kind of got scared and ran away or swam away, I guess. And, but you know, it's not apparently big on seeing wildlife. It's all about the glacier. So, and it's the scenery around it, the mountains and everything are all stunning. So yeah, I really, really enjoyed that. I have not done my ducks yet. I need to go do my ducks. There is a Beatles uh, production show coming up in ooh, eight minutes. I might not be able to find a seat if I don't get going. I might not be able to find a seat anyway at this point, but I wouldn't mind seeing that. So I will let you know what kind of mischief I get into. Solo Sue signing off. <laughs>